Time to get my kit off and get in. So here we are guys, welcome to episode 5, Yule Grieve, or actually has two spellings, you can call it Yule Grieve or Yule Grave, we call it Yule Grieve, there's lots of options for kind of parking, we decided to park in an, uh, a village a bit further downstream called Alport, um, and then you have the most stunning little walk, it's probably only about a mile up to the actual swimming spot, but this is a fantastic swimming spot. One of the great things as well, buggy friendly, <laughs> and it's it's a pool that has been built actually in the river, so they've kind of almost created like a mini dam, um, and there's a little pool in the actual river, so it's perfect for kids. I think this is probably the best spot if you want to come with kids. What would you say, Anna? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah and again, buggy friendly. A bit later on in the year I am going to do the top 10 walks in the Peak District and there will be one round here that will finish with a pub lunch but we are racing an ominous black cloud right now so need to crack on. <laughs> So we're just coming up to the road now. You can park at the road, but it does get very busy here in summer, as you would imagine. So I think you're better off parking in Alport and walking up, because it is a lovely walk as well. And it's not too long. There are also other spots that you can park at in Yule Grieve and then walk down to it. Here we go. So here it is, oh, this is such a great spot, it's probably four foot deep at its absolute maximum and all along the stream, like downstream, upstream, you can paddle, kids can play in it, honestly it's such a great place for kids. And then behind me you've got this huge grass verge where you can sit and there's loads of space and there's a bench up at the back. So. If you wanted a proper family day out, this would be an ideal place for it. And even the sun's coming out. <laughs> it's usually very busy, but when you go on a day where it's scheduled to be a storm, it's a bit quieter. So now, time to get my kit off and get in. Every single spot I go to, I just end up thinking, oh, that's my favorite spot now. <laughs> this is so beautiful. It's just absolutely incredible. I love this. What a great thing to do. You know, creating 
creating like a little dam and creating this brilliant natural pool. The water is crystal clear, it's perfect for kids. I'm so excited to bring Fox here when he's a bit older. So there we go, we were getting a bit smug thinking that we'd avoided the storm, but no, not happened. <laughs> Quick getaway from the swimming spot. Uh, we're sheltering right now under these trees and under a, a bit of cliff. Ideal. Okay. Yeah. So that's episode five, done and dusted, you'll grieve. Yeah. I say this all the time, but that actually might be my favourite. I'll come to a definitive decision at the end. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I'd really recommend you come and check this spot out, especially if you've got kids. It's a perfect spot um, for them. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, um, and also just share it with as many people as you can. And stay tuned for number six coming up soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers. Bye. way back go treat yourself to a proper bake well tar lovely